Kyle Mosley is our senior profile this week, and he had an interesting comment to me earlier this week. He said, it's the seniors that are going to have to lead the way in, in making us believe we can win. Well, I think the seniors on his team, Jack, I think he's true. Yeah, he's, he's, he's telling the truth. I think our, our seniors have never had a losing season. They're guys that have experienced it all. I mean, they've, they've been, most of them have been here five years, and they've been up and down and back and forth, and they understand what power they have to turn things around. And I think they're the prime guys that can, they can help get it done. I think, you know, as I said, I think a lot of us got to do a better job, but I think the seniors can have a big impact on that. Kyle Mosley's a beautiful person. He's a guy that uh, has just uh, gotten a lot out of college football, and he's given college football a lot, and we're real proud of him. Here's a guy that's going to make you smile. Our senior profile this week, right? wide receiver Kyle Mosley. And when I was a freshman, we've always had a pretty good receiving core. We had, you know, Dwayne Coleman, Ron Pinnock, Merv Lopes, you know, all good guys. And it's like sooner or later my day will come. And throughout my five years here, uh, I've had Walter the whole time, and it's been like, you know, Walter's the man, and then I'm behind Walt. So it, if there's anybody I'd like to be behind, you know, Walt's the man. <laughs> Fifth-year senior Kyle Mosley is part of a tradition of quick, sure-handed rainbow receivers. As a senior at Lelihua High, Mosley was voted to the Adidas All-American football team, and he captained both the football and basketball teams. This year's receiving core is very close, and together they've come up with the perfect pregame meal. Oh, Saturdays at the hotels. Um, we take at least two bags of Oreos to the hotel and a half a gallon of milk. And we're just, all, the, all the wide receivers are sitting there dipping their Oreos in milk and just devouring bags of them. <laughs> Is that the secret to the wide receiver's success here? I don't know if it's a secret, but I tell you, I, I love it. <laughs> I love it. I love eating Oreos. <laughs> As a backup to Walter Murray, Kyle's playing time has been limited, so he's made the most of his time on the field. Most memorable game for you? <laughs> Without a doubt, it has to be BYU last year. Um, we played hard, but we didn't win. But I had the longest catch of my life, and uh, at the same time, I got caught from the back by you know, one of their DBs, and it was a big joke about that, but I've never been known for my speed, so, you know, whatever I could get out of it, I was happy about it. And then in the same game, uh, David Dias, who was at Guiar then, blocked the punt, and I recovered it, and uh, it was my only touchdown since I've been here, and I've always, I'll always remember that. People will get sick of me talking about it, probably, but I'll always remember it. What are you studying? Uh, I'm majoring in communications, and uh, hopefully I'll graduate in May. What do you want to do with that? Another one at once? That's his job. <laughs> <laughs> the general's job will be secure, at least for the rest of the football season. But watch out, because Kyle is learning from the John Madden School of Broadcasting. We're watching the replay now. Okay. And you're streaking up the sidelines. Then you're cutting towards the uh, towards the post. Oh, God, did you see that play? It was a great catch. Mosley's got down in a dirty dome out. He laid out for the pass. It was great. Now, that's football. I haven't seen a guy play like that since, since, since I was a coach back at the Raiders. I mean, those guys were tough. They were nasty. We had mean, ugly guys, just like Mosley. It was great. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of goals did you set for yourself this year? Uh, Football-wise? Um... Anything-wise. Well, to graduate, to get my degree before I, um, time was up. Uh, to have a good year, to help the team, you know, do good uh, in any capacity that it took. You know, if it meant for me to run scouting, that, that was what I would do, and I would do my best at it. If it meant um, stepping in and playing and, you know, whatever it took, I just wanted the team to do good, and wherever I fit in, I just wanted to do my best or whatever it took. Practice, meetings, film, training, and games. Playing for the University of Hawaii is a very big commitment. Has it been easy for Kyle? Um, easy, I don't know, but it's been worthwhile. Uh, they, you know, they say anything worth having is worth fighting for. And I feel that, you know, going out and practicing and the treatments when you get hurt and spending those hours in the training room and those extra hours on the field catching passes or getting one step right or working on this one route. Uh, 
I feel like it's helped a lot. Uh, I've enjoyed it. It's, it's been unique. It's been fun. It's been ups and downs, but it's been fun.